Course OSTS, motherfuckers! Hello, YouTubers and all those who happen to watch. Don't take what I say seriously. I'm just an interweb. So, okay. Legends of Aetherius. Or Aetherus, should I say. Because it's the Aether. If you say it wrong, people come and shoot you in the face. I, I guess this is how uh, the said geek posse rolls. But yeah, this game is still in development. It has some issues. I'm not going to say it doesn't, nor will anyone else. If they don't, then they are obviously a super, super duper fantastic fanboy who needs to go outside and see some fresh air and as well as see some sunlight. Then come back in the house and they'll be like, holy shit, you're right. But all right, we're going right into the multiplayer. Don't ask me. I was a young boy at this time. But I made a character real quick to see, uh, basically testing out settings. and <clears throat> Yeah, settings, that's what I'm going to call it. But now we're going to create a new character. We're going to actually make a inventor. Make him a female. We're going to name him. I guess we don't have the backspace. Usually when you develop this shit, you'll see enter your name here. You have to end up backspacing all that because if you don't, you'll end up having the name enter your name here. Which is sort of like a weird, old-fashioned, sloppy way of editing things. So just for the sake of this video, we're going to call it uh, Review Doll. Even though it's technically not a see he came in backspace, so that kind of sucks. Review doll. Okay, kind of a unique little name, but just using that for the purposes of this said video as I bang and clash everything all over my desk. I need a light because I can't see my keyboard too well. It is dark as shit in here, so bear with me. All right, everything is all nice now. We're playing in a multiplayer, so that way we can try to hopefully... I'm not going to do hardcore, fuck that. <laughs> I will throw a chair if I have to. But yeah, this is the customization screen, as you can obviously tell. Only oh, don't say, Daniel. Captain Obvious shoots with streams of lightning. You can change colors of the eyes, anything you want. The blind one looks pretty cool, but I personally like to go with the, you know, the, the realistic look sometimes. Eyes down, up. You can, I guess, build whatever the deep shit you want, so. Detail behind these characters are really good for this team, I, I'll definitely say. A little bit of depth. Um shallow eyes wide like that you can change anything you want I'm not gonna do anything wacky I'm gonna keep it um, I would say realistic again nice that smiling guys look or oh, oh, oh. like she just seen a ghost we'll keep it like that <laughs> the eye size you can make them enormous or small or enormous or small you can kind of see through a little bit through the uh the eye there but that's that's fine I ain't gonna notice that I'm playing the fucking game so the body type we're gonna actually give her some muscle a bulkiness yeah the inventors in this game use ranged weapons as well as turrets as I remember correctly and it's kind of a it's a kind of, it's a fun class oh shit oh god damn it it goes all my work oh, I kind of like that actually that kind of works. All right, I guess that works. We'll just add a little bit of the muscle back. Because the reason why I do big muscle because it makes the armor look bulky, and I like bulky armor. So uh, this girl here, need to change her hair. I'm not liking the uh, short red shit, though. I like, uh, usually like a black blonde or, again. That whole entire dominatrix look there, the mullet, which looks kind of cool. The fuck? Oh, all right, I see. That's because of the makeup. I'm going to change right about brows, too, because I'm not really digging that too much. I'm going to do the, the Ellen Degenerate look. Or Degenerate look. You can change the eye color. Again, this is a really cool game. Oh, Jesus Christ, oh, Lord. And sound like that, that uh, scientist guy from Futurama. Don't even remember half the character's name. I only think I remember is like a fry, and that's it. I don't really watch the damn show. 
See, that's the thing, too. I don't even really watch The Simpsons or the South Park or anything like that. This is because I'm trying to be like a hipster. It's just because I, I don't know. It's just the humor, after a while, it just kind of feels bland. So, therefore, I just don't give a shit about it. See, I don't know what it is about this this mohawk look recently. I have this fixation with women with mohawks, too. It's Just call me weird. But, uh, okay, we're going to give her some eyebrows. Oh, there. Give her a little bit of a bushy eyebrow. There we go. Change her eyes, though, because we give her something that will... I guess complement the color of the face paint. Red. That's dark brown. That isn't red. Actually, I'm kind of digging that. Yeah, actually, I'll keep the blind. So you get different kinds of settings here, but I'm not going to mess with them today. I'm not going to waste any more of your time. All right. I'm going to add that to make, those, make that black. Hopefully. <laughs> I think. Uh... Uh, what the fuck? You can't even... What, huh? Whoa! That is some fucking... That's some crazy shit there. Alright. How's this going crazy? Kind of digging that. Though I'm going to kind of lower the... Yeah, look like, make it look like a fucking clown. All right. The lips. We're going to give her some full black lips. Even though that gets kind of not a dark brown, but whatever. The head needs to be a little bit bigger. That's like the smallest goddamn head I ever saw in my life. That's eyes. Cheek, jaw, mouth. Uh, looks like we can't. Yeah, it looks like we can't. Uh, let's change the tone of her color. A little bit of Middle Eastern look, I think. Kind of like that. Native American kind of look. Yeah, we'll go with that. She's a Native American girl. Alright. Uh, warp. She kind of has war paint on already, I think. Is that a tattoo? Is that a tattoo? Oh, it is a face tattoo. Cool. Alright. Again, you can change different ones. You can have that, uh,. Dr. Manhattan, because I kind of caught on what that is. All these are, I guess, sort of reference to certain... There you go, a little bit of feathers. Nice, uh, clean Native American look there. Uh, tattooed body. I, I wouldn't be able to know. Armor off. That could be a pervert, I guess. But no, that's a tramp stamp. I don't want no damn tramp stamp. Fuck that shit. All right, we're gonna go with that. Go with that old school Native American look. Even though I know that's sort of, I, some people say that's racist. No, it wasn't. That was kind of how they dressed back in the day. You know, the warriors kind of had that that gimmick going there for them. That tradition. So I'm not gonna bash it. I'm just gonna embrace it in this uh, this character. I have some small fragment of Native American in me, so fuck it. I don't give a shit. <laughs> I'll do what I want. Leg tattoo. Okay. Give her hips some of those that uh that tribal Samoanish look. Or something completely different. I don't know. Whoever knows what kind of tattoo specifically that is. I mean, I know that it is a tribal tattoo, but I, uh, whatever it can be, just uh, say where it's descended to this from. If you are a Conjure sewer of tattoos. Eh, let's give her some paws. Why not? She's in some fit shape. Alright, tattooed body. And we'll... That's a sacred symbol there. Sacred symbol again. We'll keep that. Okay, we'll put the armor back on. Give her some respect. And there we go. She kind of reminds me of a uh, wolf there from... What the hell is it called? For Mortal Kombat. Anyone's even in the game? <laughs> nope. <laughs> There's like no one on this damn game right now. I'm being dead sick. Look at that. Oh, 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 oh. 13 players. I was wrong. Oh, 
Yep, that was that was pretty funny. We'll search through the games and we'll find a random game to join. Again, this is a, still a fresh title, so to speak. Three Gates are actually... Div they're, they're, they're putting a lot of effort, I can tell, into this title. Little pieces here and there. Uh, actually, fuck it, we'll just create a game. Make it a co-op quest. We'll make it review dolls game, land game, optional password, whatever. So you could play this locally with some buddies at your house. Just gonna hit ready. We're just gonna go. It don't matter. I've seen this intro like 50 million gazillion times, but we're just gonna do it again anyway. Then of course I'm gonna start. Derp. We're gonna start off in this town, which kind of has that Middle Eastern kind of look to it, mystical and robust, I guess. Hopefully the sound in the background is not too drowning of my voice. I've been tinkering with different games whenever I play them and The Kagal tribes are pushing further and further down into the Nargal, Lieutenant. The mining settlement was completely ransacked. Amidst the chaos, I saw this settler single handedly take on eight Kagal warriors before the Serpentika shaman drenched the poor fool in eight of them. It's a miracle the settler survived. This he, he he sitting there did that. Use the double key to move forward. Follow Lieutenant Process to Alana. Little bit of lag. Yeah, I'm feeling a little bit of lag. Shouldn't be. Yeah, it's it's very choppy, so I need to uh, tinker for some stuff here. Yeah. Okay, the anti-aliasing is not on. That's probably why we'll just turn it to high for now. There, a lot better. Usually, when I don't have the uh, recorder on, that's when. Graphics can be use a little adjustment though. I mean, I understand this is an independent company, so they don't have as many resources and tools that they would like, but this is still a nice looking game. Still very impressive looking. Are you ready for Better than anything I could do, because I'm obviously cannot do any of this shit, so. Please make haste. I would love to be a voice Before actor. Before you get out into the Galleon frontier or train in the arena, you will want to add your character attribute points. The attributes are agility, perception, intuition. I like how they pronounce it. Agility, perception. Like he was just like very formal about it. He's like, if you don't like it, you can kiss my ass. Okay, constitution. Give him a little bit of. Give him some of that. Put 25 into that. Willpower, stamina, health, concentration, generation. We'll add about 15 to that. There we go. Six more intuition. Yeah, we'll put more into that. Uh, see if I need to make any adjustments. Someone's probably plays this game all the time, so I'm gonna see what I did, and they're gonna be like screaming in pain and horror. Even though it's me. Fuck. What the hell? Christmas has been over for a while, buddy. <laughs> I'm sorry. I just see that fucking monster with a hat on inside. It's making me crack up. Alright, I'm doing the main quest. I'm not doing that. I think the last time I did that, I got my ass whooped because I was under leveled. Took an arena, but I mean, as long as they still have that event or keep some of the events still in this game, that's pretty wild. Or they most likely gave up on the game. One of the two. 
So uh, go to like Cartia, talk to Sabrina, collect the beacon primer. Or primer, yeah. The reason why I'm playing this game at the moment is because of the fact that Final Fantasy XIV is uh, doing their maintenance for the... This right here is a shop, which uh, can build stuff. This right here you can use to build stat... E. You can use this to you build. You get materials throughout the world or throughout the game, such as copper, iron. You can see right there, making a monster or making a creature there. You can. Uh, you can do different poses. You can change the thing, that thing. You can make a, a duplicate of yourself. Really cool stuff, man. I like like the uh, personalization that they add to each person's uh, city. So every time you complete a quest, by the way, you go to this thing right there. But uh, let's talk to this Hello, guy. Problem. What are you buying? What are you selling? <laughs> I'm David Bowie. All right, let's get into. Everyone's asking me why the hell I keep on doing that, doing the David Bowie thing. It's it's because it's a inside joke with me and uh, Strictly Sega. We. I made I made this one night, which is a random thing. I burst out with it. He's like, "What the fuck?" And he started laughing. It was like a response to it. It was so I keep on rolling with it. Ha 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 ha! Whoa, that lag. think I'd be able to pick these up, but just testing out controls. Wish shift was to run though. This game would be a lot better, I think, with uh, a gamepad. Alright, now we need to go to the beacon. Really, this game is fun. I mean, it's, it's it has a lot of negative flack, which I understand why, but at the same time, it's still a pretty good game. I got this to review a while back, or at least preview, and it's I'm waiting for it to fully blossom before I uh, I write anything up for it. Just to be fair for the company. I mean, I did write a little preview for it a while back, but that was it. A little uh, rough draft, so to speak. And I had a lot of positive things to say about the game. It certainly has a uh, has depth behind it that I mean it's not noticeable at first. Oh, I get. It. That's kind of cool. So, uh, but yeah, this is a game I would say for a lot of hardcore enthusiasts of uh, games like but Gothic. It just reminds me of that. Just underneath the brim of that. And Gothic's a pretty outstanding game. Yep. Yeah. This combat kicks my ass every time. Pick up. Come on. Pick it up, bitch. There we go. You called her a bitch. A derp. It was shift. That's why I wasn't blocking. I was pressing right click. I was just like this. Oh, it is. All right. It was Perry. I was right. What the fuck? <laughs> yeah, it's a good game. I, I, like. I keep on saying that. So people go, yeah, he's going to eventually get bored of the game. Mm, not necessarily. I just bounce on it from time to time to see if... Uh, Like it just blows out like that's like a nice touch. It just goes poof everywhere. Like a lot of this game has some elements of Monster Hunter as well, where some of the combat sort of loosened of that. Yeah, if you want to look at your character's frontal view, I forgot how you what you press. Yeah, it was F to kick. That's what it was. Bring him back all the uh, controls into my cranium. C is for character. 
Here comes this dude. It's a Sparta, motherfucker. A little bit of a cool down with the, the foodies. That way. Controls are a lot more responsive, actually, than the last time I played this, which is nice. Which is actually pretty damn nice. The hell? Two points, so start skills. Smoke bomb's okay. Uh, long roll. The mines are alright. Uh, they're not that great though. I prefer the turrets. Really good support. You also have like materials you use to cast spells in this game so I guess that sort of make it make sense. And uh, let's see. Gotta find this quest mob. Krogs. Or Krog. Alright. Fuck is he? Gotta take care of that ad. Ah! David Bowie. The hell I got stuck into him. Smoke two OP. Yeah, get the fuck off. Alright. I guess I built my stats okay. Alright, got nothing else here. I have the stone key apparently, so now I need to go over here, get the fuck off this this shithole. That's an ugly looking sword though. Let me zoom in on that. See like mildew or mold on there. Cosmetic wise it makes sense, but the uh just the mold or the mildew or the moss. There we go, the moss in that sword is kinda grody. Gotta wait for the ship to arrive, so I gotta hold off. You can't break those. Those cuffs. Oh! Fuck you. Huh! <laughs> that ragdoll. Keep on farming these guys all you want. This is actually a lot better if people are with you. <laughs> What the fuck? That's like the coolest glitch ever. Whatever, I'll eat a uh, mango fruit here while I'm waiting for this bitch. Oh, I gotta shoot the signal flare, I think. Um. Alright, whatever. that for now. Um, 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 um. <laughs> My 
Where the hell's a signal flare? Let's just pick a signal flare around here somewhere. Up there? Oh, the lever, that's right. I gotta go over here and pull it. Looks like I got rid of the mobs, though. Let's save some effort. There we go. Takes like 40 something seconds for that to get here. As you can see right there, Captain Obvious strikes again. That's still making me crack up. Our right, dares at the the pinnacle of this game right there. That's what that was. See, there's games like bugs like that are just entertaining, and they don't. I don't think they ruin the game at all. They actually add something to it. <laughs> this game has like those nice primitive touches to it that uh, I would say it adds something to it. That's all I can generally say. All kinds of quests in this game. Also, build a little statue there. So, if you like the certain materials, like I have plenty of that. Plenty of that. Hungry like a wolf. And we'll make it a musket rat. Alright. Put it like that. We'll craft a statue. And there you have it. I just completely wasted materials on something that really didn't need to be made, but it, I made it anyway. I don't give a shit. So there we go, we're gonna go all the way back. See the, the market as well in this game is pretty active as well. You can see there's like a ton of NPC, not like a million, billion gazillion, but just like enough to make it seem like it's active. Good work. Good work. You're covered in gold. Can I hug you, Noah? Are you ready, friend? Oh, I'm ready. Let's take our armors off and let's let's spoon. I hope to see you soon. Oh my! But now we gotta make some armor now. There's like a ton of other stuff you can go around here and do. So, for example, I think it's here. I think. No, it's, I'm wrong. Uh, what the heck is this NPC? No, it's nowhere to be seen. Nowhere to be seen. Sunk in her sunken dreams. He's in the seat with the clearest view. I totally butchered all the lyrics there just now. I don't give a shit. I don't give a fuck. There's all kinds of little statues here now. Girl, get some boobs. Get some boobs. Look at you, you got no boobs. Get some boobs. I'm not looking at you anymore. Get some boobs. Develop boobs now. Go. Go out in the wilderness and develop a big pair of boobs that will smack my head off. Like decapitate my my quote unquote sexist ass. Ast. Is ast such a word? Ast. I don't even know anymore. So okay, when I'm going to go to this shop here. What can I do for you? So they could have had some I mean, the English is good, but it's just... <laughs> Alright. Build a...
We're gonna build a David Bowie. Alright. Can certainly do better than that. Alright. What? <laughs> Don't cost any sort of mahogany? That made me, cr that made me uh, chuckle there. I should have just went with it. Alright. Okay, I see what happened there. That's kind of shitty. I can't really build too much. Uh, how much cash do I have on me? Shit. Okay, it looks like I can build this. I guess this part really don't matter, just for the looks. Looks really dope. Wow, I can't believe I used that word. Ah, uh, just shoot me now. I'm gonna craft it. Armors. It should be just like uh, what armor? Does it just one? Got plenty of um, plenty of gear for that. You're crazy like a fool. About daddy cool. Oh, that's what's better. All right, I was totally looking at this thinking that was that up there. And I was like, damn, these are kind of shitty. All right, let's look at this gear here. <laughs> wow. Damn, at least I had that. Looks okay, I suppose. I'm actually kind of digging that right there. That one's actually pretty cool. Like that scholar mail. Okay, now I need to make some boots. Mm. Boots I'm wearing apparently are better. Oh, you're shit. Uh, I shouldn't have done that. That was not smart. 
Alright. Looks like we'll have to build shit later hey, on. Well. Well, John Lennon was talking to me for, for a minute. Alright. Add some points into the aim because that's obviously important. Okay, it's that button. And we'll give her some better crap. Okay. I wish I could actually see what the armor looks like. I guess this will have to do. Looks pretty. Good, I guess, if I can actually see what the fuck it looks like. Uh, OP? I don't, I don't know. Alright, I don't even goddamn know how to control the game anymore. So, alright, that's a little bit of this for now. Give me a couple aspects of the video game itself. I mean, if you do like what you see, be sure to support the game. So, take it easy.